Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to in the first episode of War Plays The Witcher, or Witcher 3 if you want to call it that. But, uh, so, funny story, I recorded about 30 minutes of gameplay for a commentary I was going to do over the video, but, uh, that didn't work out so well, so here I am doing a live commentary, maybe do like a, uh, a short 10, 20 minute video, and... Here's my horse. If you don't know, you can ride your horse around this game, and it actually makes it a lot easier to get around. Especially since you, if you see the, how big the city is, it's it's crazy. <laughs> my allergies are balling me up today, so if I have to turn away and sneeze, I do apologize. But yeah, I got this game yesterday, downloaded it, I got the digital copy, and uh, I didn't get this expansion pack yet, but honestly, after playing it for a, a, a good while now, I probably will, because I played it for about five hours yesterday, and I don't even know how, I don't even know if you could track your time, so I might have, of course, I did have a lot, of, a lot of breaks in between, so I might not, I don't know exactly how much time I actually spent in the game yet. Hopefully there's a tracker so I can, you know, tell, because uh, I would like to actually know that. I would deal with them, but I, I kind of just don't want to. Don't want to. You put your sword up now. Uh, this is a long way away. Hopefully it's in here somewhere. Nope, still going. Of course there's like a little city or something over here, I think. Okay, maybe not a little city, but there's uh, refuges everywhere. <laughs> Huh? What do you want? Hear about the notice. Got monster trouble? Trouble? <laughs> Good one. We're not having trouble. We're up shit fucking creek. Some shaggy fuck knows what sitting in the woods attacking every plow and transport that dares take the high road. We need out of bolts, arrows, rations, all around fucked. Sent a patrol out. Looks never came back. So the job's simple. Bring me the fucker's head, and I'll give you gold. As much as the notice says, I'm not gonna haggle. Quartermaster won't budge. But I can throw in a pass that'll get you across the Pontar. So, deal? Sounds fair. See what I can do. So, uh, I'm actually gonna cut that out where. So you guys don't hear me, my mic going crazy during that, uh, during that uh, conversation. Basically, now when you're on a contract, you got to examine the site and see what's actually doing all this attacking. Because I don't think they know specifically what's doing all the attacking. Like here, you can use your Witcher sentence to uh, tell. So ho hopefully, it's not something too hard, or or it's well. Honestly, I, I'm playing on the lowest lowest difficulty, so it probably shouldn't be. And but you know, th yeah, this world is huge. It's absolutely massive. Like I think there's, I don't think you see the tree from here, but there's this big tree in the swamp where if you see it, it looks like just part of the background. But you can actually go to it, and there's actually a quest right right at it. I think. All right, so here we are at the site. We gotta examine. Is 
So now we gotta do. Let's gotta look around. So I, uh, I have it marked where you guys should see it on the mini-map, so it's a lot easier. So it's actually starting to look like more bandit attacks. Okay, I already see. Yellow is already seen. So like the stuff in red is actually where the quest is. You gotta just follow it. And it's actually pretty cool. It's like a kind of a investigation scene. Drowners. Whoa. So you actually see the footprints is on on the footprints footprints on the ground. That's actually kind of cool. So it looks like they're leading up to this hill. One step more, and you'll gain a new hole in your head, Dwan. What do you seek here? Speak. Need to talk to your commander. It's important. I don't trust you. Figured as much when I saw your bow aimed at me. Still have me in your sight. And I'm just not prone to doing stupid things. I can assure you of that. I'll be assured when you hand me your weapons. Come on, your swords. Drop them, and I'll take you to Venosio. Afraid I can't agree to that. An error. The last you'll ever make. Et me! Okay, I gotta take out this archer first. Oh, I, I can't take him out, I don't think. I actually have this uh, crossbow that has unlimited ammo. So, it's kind of cheap. So, I'm actually going to go ahead and meditate for an hour. And if you know what this means, it means you just kind of rest. You play Skyrim, it's rest. Alright. So, that was it. It just be about 10 minute video or so. What am I doing? I'm a horse. So, basically, it was just elves. Yeah, I'll probably do. I'll, I'll well, not probably. I'll actually, I'll definitely do more videos than this. It'll probably be short things like this. I don't want to do the main quest stories because you know you kind of want to start from the beginning with that stuff. I'm already uh, really, really uh, into the game right now. 
into the spoiler alert kind of stuff. So, I'll try not to talk about it too much. I heard there's different endings, though. I hope that's true. Like, they're based on the choices you make. You know, who you kill, who you don't kill, or uh, I guess, stuff like that. You're back, finally. Did you get the beast? No beast to speak of in the woods. Just elves from a Squayat's Hellband that attacked the convoys. Here, they're squirrel tails. Scoyatel, you say? Hmm. And I thought we'd exterminated the last of those vermin. And the non-humans left had wised up. Well, seems we'll need to pacify them again. Make a list of all the long ears around, and hang every tenth one. That should do it. Yeah, definitely. I see we're of a mind on this. You're a good man. Here, the gold I promised you. And the pass. Alright, so I hope you guys enjoyed this short video. So, uh, I'll see you guys later.